In this video, I'll show you how to make dry ice on demand at home for cheap. I learned of the concept from this great video by the King of Random, Grant Thompson. His method uses a CO2 fire extinguisher, but in my video, I'll show you how to do it using readily available paintball tanks. There's a trick though. All you need is a refillable paintball tank and a remote line or a hose, pipe nipple, and a tank fill adapter. First, attach the pipe nipple to the fill adapter and push on the hose. Then, spin it onto the bottle. Now here's the trick. CO2 fire extinguishers have a siphon tube so that the gas pressure inside forces liquid CO2 out when fired. Paintball tanks do not. If you open the tank while it's upright, only CO2 gas will come out. However, this can easily be solved by just holding the tank upside down. While wearing gloves, place a thick bag over the end of the hose. Hold the bottle upside down and let it rip. So how does it work? Well, CO2 only exists as a liquid under extreme pressures. When the tank is open to the atmosphere, the liquid expands into a gas, and with the pressure drop, this creates a large change in temperature. This supercools the hoses and fittings, and as more liquid CO2 comes out, some of it crystallizes on the cold surroundings, forming dry ice. In my next video, I'll show you how to make an efficient machine that produces much more dry ice than this method. As always, there's more information in the description.